E aí, eu sou o Felipe, estou aqui no canal do Jetforce hoje para mostrar mais um jogo indie para vocês. Como todos podem perceber, eu sou um caçador, digamos assim, de jogos indie. Estou sempre procurando algum jogo legal aí. E eu sou um pouco fissurado por jogos estilo cell sharing, né, os gráficos, né, estilo desenho, meio uh, cômicos assim, né? Como esse Full Throttle aqui que eu achei E o que mais me chamou a atenção também é que ele é um jogo fácil de ser platinado Se você não cortar nenhuma cutscene, porque pra quem não sabe ele é uma remasterização De um jogo estilo aqueles movies, movie, não sei como é que vai falar o nome né É tipo um filme onde você vai tomando decisões e executando algumas ações Você não controla o personagem assim propriamente dito então ele é um jogo fácil de ser platinado, pelo que eu vi, em duas horas dá pra platinar se você jogar uma vez só ele. Mas se ficar algum é, troféu pra trás, o que pode acontecer, vai ter que jogar de novo. Então, sem mais delongas, eu vou começar aqui. Vamos já para o novo jogo. O jogo tá legendado em português, produzido pela LucasArts. Whenever I smell asphalt, I think of Marine. That's the last sensation I had before I blacked out. The thick smell of asphalt. And the first thing I saw when I woke up was her face. She said she'd fix my bike. Free. No strings attached. I should have known then that things are never that simple. Yeah. When I think of Marine, I think of two things. Asphalt. And trouble. Rip Burger, you're dumber than dirt. Oh, Mr. Corley, if you'd only listen to my plan, my vision. I know your plan, Rip Burger. You're waiting for me to die so you can take over my company. Well, sir, that's horrible. I am not waiting for you to die. You know I've never liked you, Rip. But you have business know-how and killer instincts that I respect. Why, thank you, sir. But this latest idea of yours, riding up to our shareholders' meeting with a gang of bikers? Who do you think you're fooling? The shareholders, sir. It's good PR to be seen hobnobbing with real Corley Motors customers. What do you know about our customers, Adrian? You've never even been on a bike. Well, you know I'd be on one right now, sir, if it weren't for my destabilizing inner ear condition. Ah, your ears are fine. It's what's between them that scares me. <laughs> Ironias. Não vivemos sem. Trilha sonora legal, hein? Now there go some boys I can ride with. Step on it. Let's find out who they are. Está provavelmente o nosso protagonista. Muito estilosa essa abertura. Gone and Jacker. É isso? Vou dar uma procurada na... nos YouTube da vida aí.
Muito legal. Hey, Ben. Hmm. You know, Ben, we're broke. Yeah. And if some cash doesn't come our way soon, we're in big trouble. Relax. I have a feeling something's coming our way. Something big. Ah, tem um faro bom. Parece Charlie Sheen falando no Charlie yeah, Harper, na verdade, né? Here, no seriado. This place is bikers only. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Who's the guy that drove over my car? Oops. What could possibly be taking so long? Maybe old man Corley got himself in trouble. Yeah, maybe they took the old guy out back and worked him over with a two by four. Hmm, an appealing notion, but improbable. More likely, he's boring them to death with some tale of the glory days. <laughs> but Malcolm, isn't that illegal? Not back then, it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> so, who do you ride with these days? He rides with me. Although I'm sure he'd much rather be riding with your little club. I told you to wait out in the limo, Rip Burger. I thought you might like some help with your sales pitch, sir. Sales pitch? Yes. We've come here today to offer you and your men employment. Mr. Corley requires an escort to the annual Corley Motors shareholders meeting. Does this look like an escort service to you? You would be well compensated for your time, of course. Not interested. It's uh, fairly obvious that you could use the money. Listen, I said we're not for rent. The Polecats are not goons for hire. Not even if it were Malcolm Corley's dying wish. Rip Burger! That does it! I'm gonna... Hold on there, Malcolm. If you don't mind, I'd like to step outside with Mr. Ripburger for a little chat. Excellent idea. And the doctor says he only has a few months to live. That's bad news for all of us. He's not just a nice guy. He's also the last motorcycle maker in the country. What happens to Corley Motors if he dies? Don't worry. I have a plan. And if you come to the shareholders meeting with us, you'll find out what it is. No dice, Rip Burger. The Polecats are not thugs for rent. If you want to buy muscle, you should go find the rot wheelers. The old man says it's the Polecats or nothing. Then I guess it'll have to be nothing. Hmm. And that's your last word? That's it. Well, I'd like to make you just one final offer. <laughs> <sighs> Bolus, take this coat and go get his motorcycle. We'll have to tie up this little 200 pound loose end. <laughs> It'll need to look like an accident. That stuffed shirt actually thinks I'll leave him in control of Corley Motors when I go. Boy, is he in for a surprise. Hey, where's Ben going? Your colleague has decided to accept our generous offer after all. As a matter of fact, he's gone on ahead to scout out the route. He did? Well then, let's mm. roll them, boys! Yahoo! Corbill, here we come! Controles, trocar modo de renderização, abrir menu, rodízio inventário, destaque de objetos para cima, ativar comentário para baixo, mover cursor, guiar moto, Guiar carro, triângulo abre inventário, bolinha cancela, parar de usar algum item, quadrado examinar o item do inventário, mudar equipamento da moto, dar a ré no carro, X é andar, abrir verbos, confirmar, pular diálogo, atacar na moto ou acelerar no carro. Então é isso. Opa. Aqui estamos. Ok. 
que aqui dá pra fazer. Nada, 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 nada. Vamos sair. It closed. Fechado. Eu sei que provavelmente eu tenho que pegar minha moto, mas vamos fuçar por aqui. Ali tem outro caminho. E aqui That's é where I came from. Nothing that way for me but a warrant. Vamos pegar a moto. E aí? I don't have anything. I don't have anything. I don't have I don't have anything. Ele não tem nada, eu preciso que de uma chave. Ah tá, eu tenho as opções. I've touched it enough. Que que significa isso? My lips on that. Bota a boca. Take that. Ah, agora que eu vi que tem as opções. I can't see any use for those. I can't see any use for those. Peraí, se eu chutar aquela pilha de caixas. Né, he can flatten his own boxes. Né, he can flatten his own. I'm not putting my lips on that. Vamos fuçar a bolsinha. Joker took my keys. I don't like that. Shoot that door, huh? That's it. I fixed your door. It was sticky. Look, I don't want no trouble. Just leave me out of this mess. You know what might look better on your nose? What? The bar. <coughs> Now don't mess around with me. All right, all right. I got your keys, but I don't know nothing. They had guns. They told me to stall you as long as possible. Why? I don't know. I don't know. I overheard them say something about an ambush up the road. What else? Nothing, nothing. Look, man. Here are your keys, all right? Oh, uh, someone did say something about killing you and making it look like an accident. They didn't do too good of a job there, but why ambush the pole gants? I'd better get moving. I've got nothing to say. Yeah, right. 
play. Those mines look good mounted on my handlebars. Nah. The monitor doesn't have any controls. Can't. Got a ride. Parece que é isso. Agora temos a chave. Faço para usá-la. O que eu faço? Hey, ain't you the A number one polecat honcho? Yeah, and you're in my way. Well, get used to it, bud. When the rock wheelers hit the road, we own it. Look, I'm serious. Someone's ambushing the polecats. Someone's ambushing the polecats? Oh heavens! Whatever will we do? <laughs> that does it. Come on, kitty. Let's get down. That's a Trouxa, roda e hash aqui, caralho. Peguei muito Mega Drive. <risos> ah não, fodeu. <risos> Tomei no rabo. Ah, então já entendeu o que que foi. Alguém desafrouxou a roda para que parecesse um acidente. Manjei. the better print these in color. Now, I have to get you some help, I suppose. Oh. Ah, quit moaning. I know someone around here who can fix anything. What are you? I'm a mechanic, and apparently a pretty good doctor as well. My name's Maureen. My name's Ben. Maureen. Why'd you hit me over the head, Maureen? You were in an accident. A reporter found you and brought you and your bike here. My bike? What have you done with my bike? Brought it back from the dead. Sort of like what I did with you. I need a little help getting it started. Que sorte, hein? Achou uma médica e uma mecânica. Who are you? Maureen, remember? If that's too hard, maybe you should just stick with Mo. Mo. It's an authorized Corley service center. You could call this a Corley Service Center, but I don't have the official paperwork. Ah, an illegitimate Corley operation. I prefer to think of it as a renegade Corley operation. You live in this town? Well, Melonweed's not much of a town. What's left of it is sinking about a foot a year. 
People either learn to adjust, or they leave. Which is fine with me. Not a people person? I'm just better with toasters, that's all. Do you have a last name? I prefer not to use it. What about you? Same deal. Then it's Ben and Mo forever, I guess. Where'd you learn bikes? I grew up working on them with my dad. One summer we did nothing but restore this old hardtail together. I mean, we scrubbed every bolt until it shined. But he took off one day and he never came back. So I switched to toasters. You seem more concerned with me than your bike. How's it look? It looks better than it did, but you gotta help me out. The front forks are wasted, so you'll have to get some new ones. And someone stole my welding torch. Can you believe that? I can't finish without one. And last but not least, I patched up your ruptured gas tank, but you're out of fuel and I don't have any. Where am I supposed to find all this stuff? You can hack it, tough guy. Where am I gonna find new forks? Well, they don't have to be new-new, just not broken into little pieces. You could start by asking Todd in the trailer across the way. He runs the junkyard. How am I supposed to find your torch? I don't know, set up a dragnet. Still can't believe someone would steal my torch. Who around here would do a thing like that? Where's the gas? Well, there's a whole tower full of it at the edge of town. I have this crazy, irrational intuition that tells me maybe it's worth checking out. Actually, I think I can handle it. Good. I don't have any money to pay you with. Hey, this one's free. I haven't touched anything besides a toaster for so long. Getting my hands on your hog has really been a pleasure. Well, thanks. Don't sweat it. Vai, agora no começo ele falou que ela é encrenca. Well, I'll let you get back to work. Let me know if you need any aspirin or anything. O que aconteceu? Peguei mangueira. Peguei um galão. Mo. Yeah, Ben. Well, I'll let you get back to work. Let me know if you need anything. Muito legal os gráficos. Sensacional. Bom, acho que não tem mais nada para ser fuçado aqui. Um auto. O jeito vai ser ir lá para fora. Oh, good. You're not dead yet. I might still get a quote. I heard you saved my life. Yeah, but don't worry. I wasn't trying to. I was just looking for some nice roadside disaster photos and you helped. Who'd want a picture of me bleeding? It's not the blood. It's the way you were, all well, twisted up like a pretzel. Listen, I've got to stop an ambush. Ambush? Really? Where? Somewhere between here and Corville. My crew is escorting some VIPs to the Corley Motors shareholders meeting. And there's an ambush waiting for them somewhere up the road. Uh, I... I... Yeah? This is hard for me. I... I need... Come on, man, spit it out! Could you give me a ride in your car? I've got to stop this ambush. You're right. We have to get to the ambush, all right. But I'm afraid I'm without wheels at the moment. How did you get us here? Hitched. Well, I'd better be going. All right, drive safe now. No, I see one. Aqui, aqui. I don't want to hurt Moe's mailbox. Miranda hum, Filha da puta Como assim? 
Thanks for the lift. Now she I got a quote books. for you. <risos> Bom, ela tinha dito que alguém num trailer aqui tinha o tal do garfo. Onde tem um trailer aqui? Steel bars in the glass. Steel bars in the glass. I'm not putting my lips on that. Bars. Opa. Who's out there? Hey, I'm trying to do my art in here, buddy. I don't got time to waste on bums like you. Hey, you lousy no boy who loves the food. Que viado. Bom, acho que é isso, já deu pra ter uma ideia de como é o jogo, o estilo dele, os gráficos e tudo mais. Eu vou ficando por aqui. Esse foi Full Throttle Remaster Edge, Remaster, né? E vou ficando por aqui. Então, falou, valeu, até mais, fui.